The ecological state of the Baltic Sea has improved since the 1980s when pollution peaked, but our sea remains under heavy stress. For a healthy Baltic Sea, we still need to do more. The HELCOM Baltic Sea Action Plan, or BSAP, is one of the key tools at our disposal for making our sea healthy again, achieving good ecological status. Initially adopted in 2007 and updated in 2021 by all Baltic Sea countries and the European Union, the BSAP contains about 200 measures and actions for a healthy marine environment. The BSAP covers four segments, biodiversity, eutrophication, hazardous substances and marine litter, and sea-based activities. On biodiversity, with its objective of a Baltic Sea ecosystem that is healthy and resilient, the BSAP seeks to ensure that all native species and habitats are in good health and can thrive in the Baltic, and that they are not disturbed by human activities. Eutrophication is the major environmental threat to the Baltic Sea. It is fueled by excessive concentrations of nutrients, originating from sources such as agriculture or wastewater. The results are intense algal growth and depletion of our sea's oxygen-choking marine life. Clear waters, natural levels of algal blooms, and natural oxygen levels. That's what the BSAP seeks to achieve under its objective of a Baltic Sea unaffected by eutrophication. For a Baltic Sea unaffected by hazardous substances and litter, the BSAP seeks to reduce concentrations of hazardous substances and the amount of marine litter so that biodiversity is not disturbed by pollution. All seafood should be safe to eat and litter should not cause any harm to marine life. Human activities at sea, such as shipping, fishing and construction, have an impact on the Baltic Sea and its biodiversity. The BSAP's objective of environmentally sustainable sea-based activities is intended to ensure that disturbance to the ecosystem is minimal. Shipping should be as safe and clean as possible, and underwater noise and alien species should be kept in check. In addition, the BSAP also addresses horizontal topics, including climate change, monitoring, maritime spatial planning, economic and social analysis, knowledge exchange and awareness raising, hotspots and financing. Since its initial adoption, the BSAP has resulted in a number of environmental improvements. More needs to be done, and the full implementation of all actions by 2030, as specified in the plan, will certainly take us closer to our objective of a healthy Baltic Sea. The Baltic Sea is a life support system. If it thrives, so do we.